This is how overflowing sewers brought rhubarb to Scotland. This is Prestonfield House, and it is the first place in Scotland to grow rhubarb. It all started in the summer of 1679, when former owner James Dick was elected Lord Mayor. At the time, Edinburgh had a real sanitation problem. It was an incredibly overcrowded medieval city that produced a lot of human waste. Some buildings even towered 14 stories high, and the only way to empty the chamber pot was to throw the poo out the window. But big man James Dick came along and amazingly offered to collect the waste at his own expense and bring it back to his country estate. The city was stunned that the mayor, a man of such status, would offer to do such a horrid task with his own money. But he had a secret. He was hoarding the poo of Edinburgh because he'd fallen in love with a little known plant called rhubarb, a tart and generally unpleasant vegetable stock that the mayor just couldn't get enough of. So much so that he drank the city's flowing rivers of shite straight into his own rhubarb patch as a potent fertilizer. The restaurant at Prestonfield House is now lovingly called Rhubarb, where they serve some of the finest rhubarb you can hope to find, straight from the fields and rich from the chamber pots of 17th century Edinburgh.